Hello and welcome back to this new game, Zero No Morph. Well, it's not new, but it's new for this channel at least. And I just bought it. I only have a couple of hours played on it yet, and it is fucking awesome. It's exactly like uh, the old XCOM, just newer with some modern touches. And we're gonna go veteran, of course, because why would I ever not go hard? Except in XCOM, of course. So if you see. Uh, man, you'll see me fail a lot, that's because, well, I'm new at the game, and I haven't learned all the tricks and stuff yet. So, what I have learned is that you really need more uh, interceptors, and maybe even uh, one more Sky Ranger. Um, let's see. Huh, I don't need a garage right now, I think. But I do need another hangar. And one more. Something like that. If you haven't tried this game, you really should, because it's awesome. It's exactly... I always wanted to do a remake of the original XCOM. Exactly like the original XCOM, yes, with, with better graphics and a few modern touches. And well, now I don't have to do that because it exists and it's called Xenomorph. Yeah, oh, let's see who we're going to pick as our shield guy. Lot of health, lot of strength, yeah. He's the shield guy. I'm gonna rename them after they survive a mission. Um, ah, you can keep the pistol. And I want a specialist dude. Someone with uh, pretty much strength, yeah. If that's not enough time units. Yeah, him. Yours. You're our point man. And we're going to assign each other. No, we can't. You have to remove someone. And you're pretty bad at everything. And you're even worse. So you're unassigned, and you will go to Charlie Man, which I'm going to rename it once because that's retarded. Mm, you're the Sky Ranger, dude. Sky Ranger one, and our interceptors will be Raven and Raven two, so I know which one is which. Because I'm gonna get different kinds of interceptors, and uh, if I have different names on some of them, and the third one with different name, I might just forget which one is which. So let's go do this. And of course, there's a lot of UFO activity where I didn't place my base, but maybe that's always the always the case. We'll see. Quateras, go to base. I need engineers. Engineering. If you remember that funny game, Red Alert 95. Intercept. I'm just gonna auto resolve this one because, well, I don't really need to fight it. Tail until overland, please. Cool. Auto resolve victory. And return to base, and we are going to attack, but I'm gonna... I'll rename them after. Crash site 1, intercept, go, go, go! Cool. That means I can start working on the Foxtrot interceptor. I haven't learned all the like quick commands yet, so bear with me. Maybe I'm gonna check that up at once. Uh, I wanna know 
for the toggle to get down and uh, to hunker down or uh, get down on your knees. Um, where is it? Oh, you fireworks? Okay, cool. I didn't know that. <laughs> Crouching C. Okay, that's easy. Oh, I forgot to place my troops up the way I want. Oh, that was not good. Um, that bitch has reaction shots. Yeah. As long as you don't hit me, I'm okay. Of course you're blocked. Uh, if I do this, get down. See, I'm gonna remember that. Yeah, that's okay. <laughs> Might get better shot over here. Not good enough. But yeah, he's going. He's going. Because if you manage to do it, that would be great. Because uh, your assaults are really important. Jens and Victoria. Funny if, uh, if the first alien I encounter is going to kill me. Real funny. That's how we roll. It's gonna slow and steady wins the race in this game. Take another shield with me. Mm, they're really, really good to have in uh, when you storm the UFO. That door opened, and I don't think it was a civilian. Yeah. Sweet. Trust the Germans. He's German, right? Yeah. I can kill that, right? I believe in me. Sweet. They opened the door now, I'm screwed. <laughs> We're going to try and draw fire. Yeah, you are going to... These dudes are going to try and... Scout the rest of the map while the A team over here is going to uh, uh, breach, breach the UFO. But I really, I really want my shield dude with me. It doesn't look like there's anyone else up here because uh, the aliens always move first, then the civilians, and it was a really short loading time before the civilians started moving. <laughs> so probably only one or two left, and yeah, here we go. <coughs> Couldn't you at least kill them so that you level up? <coughs> and that's, we are off to a great start. Um, accuracy, accuracy, strength, accuracy. <laughs> Uh, they didn't do a lot this mission. But we got what we wanted and that was plasma pistol and plasma rifle. Um, so I'm actually going to do this. And we'll fire that and we're going to start researching the plasma pistol. Engineering. Uh, increase. And do one more. Yeah, I want to focus on interceptors. Yeah, I do. I do, actually. 
I'm sorry if I'm just uh, not reading this and just uh, skipping them. I've already read, read them. You can always pause and read them if you want. I'll start reading them when something new comes along that I haven't read already. Oi, sorry. I need more. More scientists. And more engineers. So expensive. And my money just going there. Hmm, small one again. Let's send two of them up because it could be a Corvette or whatever you call it. They're, they're slightly bigger. Crap, I should mm, never send both on one if you don't send. But we have a Fox Trust ready for that. This I have to do manually though. Because auto resolve is zero. Uh, because they, uh, the Fox Trust only has two missiles, two avalanche missiles. And they will miss. They are, are going to dodge it. So what I'm going to do is, well, we'll see. Speed up. 